Welcome everybody back to Mainly Music. We hope you had a great week and are looking forward to some singing and dancing together this morning. As part of our session, you are going to need to have something to bang on. So I've got a bit of an old drum here. Can you see it here? Nice bright colours. But maybe you've got a plastic bowl and it's a plastic spoon that you might be able to use. And um, mum or dad or grandparents, maybe go and grab one of those now as we sing our Good Morning song. Are you ready? Good morning to you, good morning to you. We're so glad you've come today. Good morning to you. Now through this session, I'm going to be using this little black clicker to change the slides on the screen. Shall we see how we go? I'll press the button. Oh, there we go. Our first song for today, If You're Happy and You Know It. Can you clap your hands? Are you ready? You might want to hop up on your feet and we're going to sing and dance together with a great big smile on our face. If you're happy, let's clap our hands. Here we go. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. I wonder what's next. Can you stomp your feet? Stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. Can you nod your head? Nod your head up and down. If you're happy and you know it, nod your head. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, nod your head. I think the next one is jumping around. Jump around. If you're happy and you know it, jump around. If you're, are you jumping around? Up and down, I hope so. If you're happy and you know it, jump around. Woo! Well, well done. You can stop jumping now. There we go, jumping and nodding and smiling and clapping our hands and stomping our feet. All these things we can do when we're happy. Round and round the garden. Have you got your hand out? And you're going to trace your finger around it like a little teddy bear round and round the garden. Round and round the garden went the teddy bear. One step, two step, tickle you under there. Did you get tickled? Maybe you could do this to your grown up. Round and round the garden like a little mouse. One step, two step, into his little house. That was a bit fun, wasn't it? Did you get a bit of a tickle? For our next song, we're going to have five little ducks. And I've got five ducks here. And we're going to see how we go, popping them on my fingers. Now, you probably don't have some little ducklings at home. Maybe you do. But we're going to pop these on. And if not, you can just pretend your fingers are the ducks. OK? And we're going to start with five little ducks and mother duck. Oh, they're not staying on, are they? And then they're going to go for a bit of a wander. Do you like to go a bit and explore sometimes? Let's see what happens to these ducks, shall we? I've got mother duck here as well. Okay. Five little ducks already. Five little ducks went out one day Over the hill and far away Mother duck said quack, 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 quack and only four little ducks came. Oh, got three there. Four little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 quack. But only three little ducks came back. One, two, three. Three little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away Mother duck said quack 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 But only two little ducks came back Whew. 
Two little ducks went out one day Over the hill and far away Mother duck said quack 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 But only one little duck came back Just the one left One little duck went out one day Over the hill and far away Mother duck said quack 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 but no little ducks came. What? Oh, where's he gone? All the ducks are gone. Mother duck went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack 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 quack. And oh, can we see? All five. They've all come back. Cuddles with mum. There we go. I'm gonna pop those toys away. Did you all five all come back? I hope so. Okay, now we've got some more animals for this next song. We've got a kangaroo. Can you see the kangaroo here? And we've got a koala. And I couldn't find a platypus. So we're gonna make our kookaburra become a bit like a platypus with its long, long beak, okay? There we go, we're gonna try that. And can you hop up and down like a kangaroo? Your paws like this, like the paws here. Pop, pop, pop. Should we sing about that? Okay. Oh, I think it started. You ready? Kangaroo, 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 hoo hoo. Can I hop with you? Kangaroo, 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 hoo hoo. Can I hop with you? God made the kangaroo, and he made you too. Yes, he did. I love my great big God, he makes all things new. Kangaroo, 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 hoo hoo. Can I hop with you? Can you remember what's next? Koala, koala, Can I climb with you? Climb in the tree. Koala, koala, ha ha. Can I climb with you? God made the koala, and he made you too. Yes, he did. I love my great big God, he makes all things new. Koala, 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 ha ha, can I climb with you? Platypus, 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 puss, puss, can I swim with you? Platypus, 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 puss, puss, can I swim with you? God made the platypus, and he made me too. I love my great big God, he makes all things new. Platypus, 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 puss, puss, can I swim with you? Wow, lots of jumping and climbing and swimming. I think it's amazing that God has made all these animals. But you know what? I'm really glad that God has made me, me, not a koala bear. I'm really glad that God has made you, you too. Did you know that God values you? That means he places a huge, enormous, infinite value upon who you are. And he is totally interested in who you are. You know, and that's not just for the kids, that's for the grown-ups too. God values you and he's totally interested in who you are. I think that's amazing. And I guess that means that we can come to him and we can say, help with stuff. We can tell him how much we love him and how much we're enjoying his creation and all that he's made. And he is interested in us and our problems and our joys and our happiness too. And next song. This one is a bit tricky. This is um, this old man. He played one. He played knick knack on my drum. And there's different actions for each of the verses. And they are just hot up here in a bit of yellow. Most of them you can follow along. Some of them are a little bit tricky, but we'll see how we go. Are you ready? Okay, we'll start with tapping on your children's hands. This, oh, nearly. This old man, he played one. He played knick-knack on my drum with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. You tap on the soles of your feet, 
This old man, he played too. He played knick-knack on my shoe with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Maybe you can do the actions at the end of each. This old man, he played three. He played knick-knack on my knee with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four. This old man, he played four. He played knick-knack on the floor with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Five. You can push it in out. This old man, he played five. He played knick-knack on my thigh with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. This old man, he played six. He played knick-knack on my sticks with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. After six, we have seven. Stretch up. All the way to the sky. All the way to heaven. With a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Rowing back and forth, this old man, he played eight. He played knick-knack on my gate with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. This old man, he played nine. He played knick-knack all the time with a knick-knack. Paddy-whack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Can you knick-knack paddy-whack everywhere? This old man, he played ten. He played knick-knack once again. Big hug. Paddywhack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Well done, everybody. Woo! That was quite a busy song, wasn't it? I reckon if I was that old man, I'd be very tired. Mm. Now is the time for us to get our drums. So if you'd like to get your drums, and I've got a stick but you could use a spoon or anything you'd like to use. And we're going to play, it's not a new song for us at Mainly, and that's okay, it's good to do new things. But I think you'll probably know how this one goes. Are we ready? Okay, it's got loud and soft and slowly and quickly. This is my big bass drum. Do you like the patterns? We can play on the big bass drum And this is the music to it Boom, boom, boom goes the big bass drum And that's the way we do it Now can you play loudly? Let's play loudly on the big bass drum And this is the music to it Boom, boom, boom goes the big bass drum and that's the way we do it. Now we played loudly. Can we do softly? Is that possible? Well done. Nice and quietly. Boom, boom, boom goes the big bass drum. And that's the way we do it. Now we're going to play very slowly. Play slowly on the big bass Bass drum, and this is the way to it. Boom, boom, boom goes the big bass drum, and that's the way we do it. And then after slowly comes quickly. Let's play quickly on the big bass drum, and this is the music to it. Boom, boom, boom goes the big bass drum, and that's the way we do it. Well done everybody. One last bang. One, two, three, bang. We're gonna pop our drums away now. Okay, so you put those away and maybe you can play with those later. I think we might use them again next week. Now this one, is one of my favorites, the wheels on the bus. Are you ready? The wheels on the bus go round and round. And lots of different things happen. Shall we find out? Here we go. Oh, is that the bus? Better get on. Here we go. 
The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all day long. Okay, what else have we got? The wipers. The wipers on the bus go swish, swish, swish. Can you make your hands go swish, swish, swish? swish, swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, swish, swish all day long. Got the doors opening and shutting. You've got your hands like this. Open them up. Shut. Open and shut. The doors on the bus go open and shut all day long. What else have we got? People on the bus. On the bus go up and down, up and down, up and down. The people on the bus go up and down all day long. There we go. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 beep. Can you be a big noise? A horn? Beep all day long. Wow. There we go. Did you have fun doing that on the bus? I think so. For our next song, we've got a teapot. We're going to pretend to be a teapot with our handle and our spout. And I've got a teapot here. Can you see this? This is the one that we use sometimes at Mainly Music for people who might want to write something to pray about. And they can pop it inside the teapot. There we go. And then we, can, we know that someone would like some prayer about something. So we'll pop that teapot there. Can you see the handle and the spout? That's what we're going to do in this next song. Are you ready? Okay, here we are. Here's your handle, are you ready? I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, hear me shout, just tip me over, pour me out. It's a bit tricky balancing, isn't it? You know what? This is a very tricky teapot. Shall we find out what he can do? Here's an example of what I can do. I can change my handle and my spout. Now tip me over. Can you go the other way? Woo! That's a bit tricky, isn't it? Put your handle over here and your spout here. Teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, hear me shout. Just tip me over, pour me out. Make a lovely cup of tea there. I'm a little teapot, it is true. Here's an example. Are you ready to swap again? Yeah? I can change my handle and my spout. Tip me over for me. Out. Ooh, make sure you don't overfill your cup of tea. Oh, just perfect. We're going to have that cup of tea soon. But first of all, we have a new song. God Made Night Time. It's a very well-known tune, so I think you'll find it easy. And you've got to twinkle your fingers like stars. Are you ready? Let's have a go. Got your fingers twinkling? That's right. Stars are twinkling in the sky, in the sky, in the sky. Stars are twinkling in the sky. God made night time. Did you know that the planets go round around the sun? We're going to have the sun and the planets going round. Can you do that? Round the sun, planets circle round the sun. God made night time. What else do you see at night? Do you sometimes see a moon? I think so. Moon is rising big and bright. Big and bright, big and bright, moon is rising, big and bright, God made night time. Can you tell me something else that happens at night time? Yeah? 
think you're right. Go to sleep. You make your hands like a pillow. Safe and sound. I am sleeping safe and sound. God made night time. I like night time. <laughs> oh, did you wake me up? Oh, thank you. Because we haven't quite finished yet. Very nearly. We've got our tickle rhyme. Are you ready? Parents and grandparents, this is a great one to be doing with your kids and encouraging some, some good physical touch. It's a good thing. If I were a hedgehog and you were a hedgehog with a one and a two and a three, I'd tickle your prickles to give you the giggles because you'd be special to me. If I were a kanga and you were a kanga, can you see here inside? with a one and a two and a three, I'd bounce you up high, as high as the sky, woo, because you'd be special to me. If I were a seahorse, and you were a seahorse, with a one and a two and a three, I'd rock you to sleep, way down in the deep, because you'd be special to me. Well, I am a person and you are a person with a one and a two and a three. And I'll whisper in here, right here in your ear, that you are special to me. We are very special, special to our parents, special to our families, and very special to God who has made us and knows us. That's the end of our session today. Should we say goodbye? Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, we'll see you all next time for more music fun. Well, before we come to our morning tea, we've got something very special to do. We're going to sing happy birthday to seven different people. That's a lot, isn't it? We've had several birthdays over these last holidays. And we're going to sing all together for Indigo and for Savannah, who turned one, for Emma and Casey, who turned two, and for Ruby, in Eli and Joshua, who've turned four. Wow. Should we sing happy birthday to all of them? See if we can remember some of their names. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Indigo and Savannah. Emma and Casey, Eli, Ruby and Joshua. Happy birthday to you. And one big many music clap for Indigo and Savannah. Big clap, well done. And two for Emma and Casey. One, two. And four claps for Eli, Ruby and Joshua. One, two, three, four. We hope you had a wonderful birthday. And we look forward to seeing you soon as we're able to do that. But right now, we're going to go and get some morning tea before our story. See you soon. Bye. Hello, today's story is called Basil the Branch and it's a story written by Andrew McDonough. Once there was a beautiful grapevine. And on that vine lived a branch named Basil. Day, Basil started thinking, here I am, a branch on a grapevine, but look at me, no grapes. So Basil took a deep breath, wiggled his shoulders up and down, 
focused all his energy at the end of his stalk and strained with all his might. Basil opened his eyes, looked down at the end of his stalk and saw nothing. But Basil was not one to let things get him down. Obviously, I didn't try hard enough. If I try harder, if I work longer, I will produce a bunch of grapes. So Basil took two deep breaths, wiggled his shoulders up and down, forwards and backwards, focused all his energy on the end of his stalk and strained with all his might. Basil opened his eyes, looked down at the end of the stalk and saw nothing, not a single grape. But Basil refused to let things get him down. Obviously, I didn't try hard enough. If I try harder, if I work longer, I will produce a bunch of grapes. So Basil took three deep breaths, wiggled his shoulders up and down, forwards and backwards, from side to side. He clenched his teeth, focused all his energy on the end of his stalk and strained with all his might. Basil opened his eyes, looked down at the end of his stalk and saw nothing, not even a sultana. Basil was down. Obviously, I didn't try hard enough. If only I tried harder. If only I'd worked longer, I would have produced a bunch of grapes. Hi, Basil, said a voice. Basil looked over his shoulder to see who was interrupting his moment of despair. Who are you? asked Basil. I am the vine, said the vine, and you are the branch. You can't produce grapes on your own. Stop straining and just stick with me. So Basil took a deep breath, wiggled his shoulders and focused on the vine. When summer came, there on the end of his stalk was a beautiful bunch of grapes. So, what do you think is the secret of us bearing fruit? <laughs>